I figured it out. I know what it is. If you have a Jeep Renegade with the 2.4 liter engine, and when you're driving, you hear this annoying popping sound or buzzing sound coming from behind the passenger side glove box. That's where the noise sounds like it's coming from. And it's correct, it is. But you can kind of, you know, hit the gas just a little bit to maintain your speed on, you know, any kind of road. And you can do it on demand. It just goes pop, 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 or this buzzing sound when you accelerate kind of heavily. And it's super annoying and it sounds super expensive. Well, it's not. So if you go to your engine bay, um, this is your air box, right? This is where your air filter's at. Well, it sucks in air from further down. So you've got this tube, the one I have tape on. This tube goes all the way down just a little bit lower, and that's where the air actually comes in from. Well, this tube actually, right where the zip tie is, this tube opens and closes hot dog style. It's not supposed to. However, there are plastic clips that have worn out over the years. This is a 2015, so I know for sure the 2015 does have this issue. It basically opens and closes pretty quickly over and over again as you're hitting the gas in certain situations, and that's what causes it to vibrate and make that popping noise. I know it doesn't seem like that would be the issue, but that's the issue. So I've taken a zip tie and I've zip tied this tube closed so it doesn't reopen. And I've also added some duct tape. You probably don't have to do that, but the classic clips to connect this tube to the air box were also worn out. So I went ahead and I duct taped it anyways, but that's it. That's how you stop the annoying buzzing sound. It's obviously a temporary fix, but if it doesn't bother you, it doesn't bother you. It doesn't bother me. I'm the only one who works on it. So if I bring it to a shop, they're going to be like, what did you do? Why did you zip tie it? Why did you duct tape it? You should have brought it to us, blah, blah, blah. Just take your zip ties, zip tie the tube closed. You'll be fine. It won't make any rattling noises. So that's it. Obviously, the right thing to do would be to buy a new inlet tube for your Jeep Renegade. But if you hate the sound and you're on a budget, zip tie that baby. All right.